Nat's, a, Nat's in the pizzas in the side chat admitting that he's recording this hangout, and Hannah hasn't banned his ass over it. That's all That's all the proof I need right fucking there. That's all the proof I need right fucking there. As soon as he admitted to, to recording this hangout, Hannah should ban him. She hasn't. So, bam, I fucking win. You know, let me let me let me throw this at you, Rev. You ready for this one? Here it comes. This is a this is a fastball right down the middle. All right. How we are when we're on the internet is how we really are. Okay. How about that one? Personal word to Vaughn here. L listen, brother. I care about you a lot. I care about your kids. All right. Mm -hmm. Do it. I'm not a troll. Just assure us. Assure us and make sure that those that the, the firearms you do own are secure. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Let me see here. Does that work? Yeah, it works. Okay. Let's see here. Let's see if I can get it All right, can you see down there? No, um, maybe not. Let me see. There you go. See that? See that little round thing right there? That's called a lock, okay? And I didn't even know the some bitch locked. I'll admit it. I didn't know it locked, okay? I didn't. I didn't know it fucking locked, but it does. There's the lock right there. Yes, I do have the keys, and um, you know, and so I didn't need to buy an expensive gun cabinet because I've got a lock right on my fucking desk. Okay. How did you have the keys yet not know it locked? Well, um, here's the thing. All right. There is like a shit ton of keys in this desk, all right, and God only knows what they got. I mean, look, look, you know, there's just one example. Look at all the keys, all right, you know, and I was digging around here, and once I, once I seen there was a lock down there, I, I just kept trying the keys, and I found a set of keys that work it, so. So then you, you have, you have the key then currently, right? I you have the key. You could show us. And I'm the only one that has the key. You, you could, you could. Show us Absolutely. unlocking it. And Absolutely. Okay. So, well, it, it's nice because, I mean, have you priced a gun cabinet? They're not cheap. Well, listen to me, bro. If that cabinet was locked, okay, then how was it that you were so quickly able to, to tear out that fucking gun? Because earlier? I knew that shit was coming, okay? I'm not, this is not my first rodeo, bro. I know these fuckers inside and out. I know how they think. You, do, you not, do you not understand that they're already calling the police and they'll probably be out here today? See, that's how these sick fuckers operate, okay? They're looking for any way to destroy my family, to destroy my life, to destroy any type of pleasure I Von, get. Li Von, listen they're to me, bro. I, I don't listen. Von, please listen to me, bro. I don't yeah. care about the internet trolls at all. Mm -hmm. I just wait. If you do have firearms in the house, I just want you to make sure that they're secure, they're locked away, and the kids can't get to them. They're that's, absolutely that's fine, I assure right. you. Okay, brother. I assure you. you saw the lock with your own eyes. The point is, the, the guns are fine, the kids are fine, and that's all that fucking matters. So. I'm just surprised that uh, people are willing to just take somebody showing a singular lock. Uh, do you, at, Nevin, Nevin, I don't think you heard earlier this morning, so let me refresh your memory. These motherfuckers have called the police out to my house. Yeah, I heard you, you yelled. I'm still suffering from a horrible headache from your earlier. Hundreds yelling. of times, Nevin. Hundreds. Hundreds. Literally. Hundreds of times. Okay? After a while, even the police are like, hey, you know, we're being trolled. You know? Well, I would like I would like to just like, like, hey, to we're being trolled. You, but I don't necessarily you know. So I mean, you know, I mean, you know, these motherfuckers have got Manchester police on speed dial. Okay? They've got the Kentucky State Police on speed dial. You know how I know? Because they just police. Okay, hey, that's oh, fine. I don't need more yelling in my ear. Like I said, I still have a headache, but you still haven't shown the drawer being unlocked. That's all I was saying. Well, you know, I mean, I'm not going to sit here and have to justify anything to you. Because well, you justified, you justified the fact that it was locked. So why would, you justified the fact that it was locked. Okay, thanks. Uh, you justified the fact, and you showed everyone there was a lock, so I don't see why it's a huge step forward to actually because show that you have a key for the lock. You. You're not my boss. You're not my god. I don't have to justify anything. Oh, so that's why, you showed, that's why you showed the lock, right? That makes sense. I showed the that lock. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Like I said, man, you know, um, I'm, I am actively pursuing legal action against these suck fuckers.
and, and and for no other reason so that they never do this to anybody else. You know, it's too late for my marriage. It's too late for my family. It's too late for these kids back here. I'll be damn lucky uh, to be able to fend uh, me and the kids to fend for ourselves as it is. And it's all because of their sorry asses. So, you know, the only thing I can do is to uh, take these fuckers to court and sue the ever-loving dog shit out of them. And hopefully that will prevent them from doing this to somebody else's family. Because I'm telling you, look at me, look at my eyes. I can tell you right now, if you think my family is the only family they, that they're targeting, you better get a clue. Because oh, they, they've had a huge success, you know, look at the success. They destroyed my marriage, got the wife put in an insane asylum, got my kids taken away at least on five occasions. You know, I mean, it was a huge fucking success. So now they're going to do it on somebody else. Bet on it. Bet on it. They will do it to somebody else. And I can't allow that to happen with my conscience, okay? I can't have that on my conscience. So, yeah, I'm going to try and get an attorney. I'm going to sue these motherfuckers into the ground. And then I will use the proceeds to not only help my children, but to hopefully help other people's kids as well. And that's a fact. And that is a promise from me to you that I will do that. I will take that money and I will use it to help children. Okay, because these sick motherfuckers do not belong on the internet. They belong behind bars. To, to get on Skype and plot in advance to destroy someone's family is unforgivable. There is no excuse for it. There is no justification for it. I don't give a fuck how many times I get on the internet and, and say goofy shit. That is still no justification to destroy my family. None. And so, yeah, these fuckers belong in jail and they belong permabanned from the internet for life. Now, I don't know if I can actually accomplish that. Well, Vaughn, I, I think a lot of these people that you may perceive as just trolls, have it, perhaps they've just seen certain situations that have been going on in your life um, that they're concerned. You know, they, they may have overstepped their bounds in terms of, um, you know, calling CPS or any of that shit, um, and I wouldn't agree with that for one second, but... I think perhaps a lot of these people that you're, you're viewing as quote-unquote trolls are just seeing a certain situation going on here that they're like, you know, we're worried, you know. I, I don't know, just my two cents, bro. Vaughn, how often do you get to shoot your gun? How often do I shoot my guns? Um, well, I live out in the boonies, so I can go out here in the backyard and shoot them any time I want. That's awesome. Yeah, Vaughn, I, I'm not... You know, I I haven't been in this community long enough to know all the stuff that's going on with this. You know, I don't pay attention to this drama shit, so I I don't know. All I'm saying is that I I you know I've heard Sec um, talk to you, and honestly, I I don't think he's out to get you at all. Um, I I think he's just you know trying to talk to you like a friend, to be honest with you, buddy. You know, but hey. You know, I like I said, I don't know the history, so I should probably just shut up. Well, first of all, the road to hell is paved with good intentions. Number one, number two, um, you know, these guys are smooth talkers. That's Every not in the Bible, by the way. Every one of these guys are smooth talkers. They are, especially Paul Wayman. Holy fuck, man! That guy will have you. That guy, that motherfucker will have you convinced that that your fucking hair is green and that your butt is on fire. Okay, he's that smooth of a talker, okay? And they use this smooth talk, man, to manipulate. Okay, one of the reasons, the reason I ended up on YouTube, and a lot of people don't know this, the reason I ended up on YouTube is because a lot of these assholes were going to little kids and, and uh, manipulating these little kids into committing suicide, sometimes live on camera. And then they were getting their jollies off on that shit. That's how I ended up on YouTube. Is I heard that rumor and I thought, oh, well, you know, well, it's a rumor, but I'll go and investigate. I'll go see if that shit's true. Well, I ran into Annie Hans White, Last of the Eight Thirteens, Bubba Effect, and all of his cronies, who were convincing little kids to commit suicide. They were they were taunting them and aggravating them and harassing them until they literally committed suicide. And so, you know, I found out the rumors were true. And it's like, holy shit, you know. So I wanted to expose these motherfuckers. As soon as I expose them, here comes the entourage. Here comes the, you know, here comes the trolling. Here comes all this bullshit, you know. And that's that's why, because they want to protect their buddies, you know. They want to protect their, their pedophile buddies and their, and their terrorist buddies. You know, because it is terrorism. It's a form of domestic terrorism. 
All right, they're manipulating people, they're coercing people, they're they're uh, harassing people and, and slandering them and, and all kinds of stuff. You know, it is a form of domestic terrorism, in my opinion. And, uh, you know, they need to be stopped. Every one of them needs to be stopped. And like I said, I will pursue legal action. I am in the process of contacting legal counsel. And um, when I, you know, when I get a reply back and find out some more information, and we'll go from there. But, you know, these guys' big idea is that we're we're made out of Teflon, and no judge is going to touch us, no police officer is going to touch us. You know, we can get on here and harass the fuck out of people, and manipulate people, and destroy people's lives, and not a goddamn thing's going to be said or done. Well, I'm going to change that. I'm going to change that. And if I can. You know, I can't say 100% that I can, but I'm going to try. I'm just saying, every single second that you spend here on the internet, attack, you know, trying to beat back and fucking um, give a right hook to the trolls, could be spent with your children. Do you understand what I mean? I understand that, but by the same token, when you got kids, there's this little thing called me time, and you got to have it because you got to recharge your batteries. Okay, and if you don't get any me time, you're you're going to be worse wear for your kids than ever before. You get what I'm saying? You know, you got to have a little me time every now and then when you got kids. And I got three of them. Okay, so I definitely need some me time. No, that's yeah. cool. That's cool, man. But but perhaps 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 it's better spent on Skyrim and not in the Hangouts. You know what I mean? Well, <laughs> you know what I mean, bro? Because well, I mean, I see you. You get so angry. You're gonna fucking pop. It looks like you're gonna you're gonna pop a fucking I'm blood angry. vessel, bro. I'm angry because I'm not allowed to do what I really want to do to these people. No, I understand, and that's what I'm saying. You can do that virtually in Skyrim, right? Oh, but but it, I'm telling you, bro, bro, um, listen, uh, listen to me. Right. When when you're listen to me, bro. When you're when your blood pressure fucking <laughs> spikes and you're turning fucking purple, I'm telling. That's going to lessen your life, okay? And your kids need their dad, yeah. okay? They need him around, right? Mm. Oh. So, Vaughn, um, have you spoken to your lawyer about your intentions and the reasoning behind your intentions? And if so, what what's the feedback that you've I'm still, I'm still attorney shopping. <laughs> I'm okay. still attorney shopping. I am not, I have not locked into one particular attorney, although... I have, um, you know, been listening to some recommendations that were given to me by credible people, and um, okay, so so this is all at least currently just a hypothetical. It is, it is, it is a work in progress. Yeah, it's a work. All in right, progress. Okay. all right. But it's you haven't not, actually put anything into yet. motion. There's okay. nothing definite yet, but um, you know, because like I said, you know, it is late in the year. Uh, really, you need to start this shit early in the year. And I, admittedly, I didn't get around to doing that, but. You know, I'm going to I'm going to pursue this, and I'm going to get it done because, like I said, I can't let I cannot sleep at night knowing that these fuckers could do this to somebody else's family. Uh, there's no way. They've got to be banned from the internet for life. Okay, and I know there's a way to do it. I know there is. You know, because if they, if 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 a court orders them to stay off the internet and they don't, well, they go to federal prison, then, don't they? Okay, so. That's going to be one of my conditions in the court case, is that they be permanently banned from the Internet for life. And then if they break that, then they go to jail. Simple you wouldn't that. be able to get that done. I bet you I do, because when, when, when these little kids take the stand and they say that uh, they lost their mommy, yeah, I think any judge is going to side with me, dude. Any judge. 